Hi, welcome back to the 411 Mamas. It's Joanne with Just Joanne. Um, I wanted to talk a little bit today about, um, I guess, how fast time goes by when you have kids um, or a child. I have one child. Um, she is five years old. And I recently just went into like a little shell shock um, because last night I officially registered her for kindergarten that she will be starting in September of this year. And um, on the paper, they show her year of graduation. And on that paper, it said 2026. And I think I may have had a little stroke because I sat there and I looked at that paper and I said, how is this possible that I'm looking at a graduation date for my five-year-old daughter? And how is it possible that I have a five-year-old daughter right now? And then I think to myself, oh my God, I'm 33. <laughs> but um, anyway, I, I just can't believe how quickly time has gone by. I feel like it was just, you know, yesterday that I had her and she was a little, tiny little thing. And I remember that her hand, her foot was no, you know, was like this big. She was only born six pounds, six ounces. So she was this tiny little, little precious little thing that you just, oh, I couldn't, I couldn't let go of her. Like I just, oh, I couldn't let go of her. and and. It amazes me how fast she's grown. Like she's half, I mean, I'm only 5'3", but she's more than, more than halfway, half of my size. She's probably up to my, my bust line at this point. Um, and, and that's kind of petite for her, I guess, no, maybe not. Maybe she's not up to my bust line. Maybe she's just a little bit above my waist. And she's considered petite, um, for her age. Um, but... It amazes me every day to watch and see her grow and I just wanted to talk about that like how do you feel when you see that your kids are going into school public school and um, and how is it is it overwhelming to you because it is really overwhelming to me it is so overwhelming I I'm just like it's a million things jumbling around in my head because I'm a working mom so it's like, what do I do for before care? What do I do about after care? What do I do during the summer? So how how do you, um, if any of you working moms out there, how what do you do? Do you um, do you have the um, the help of your family? Do you put your children in in summer camp? Um, unfortunately, my mom is still working, so she doesn't work. You know, she works year round just like I do. So I have to figure out where to put her for the summer and um, my sister who also lives here also works so it's 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 a difficult it's difficult for me to try and figure out what to do I mean one day a week she will be with her father um, which is fine but those other three four days what am I going to do and a lot of summer camps I've found don't do part-time you know part-time schedules um, so it's just really overwhelming and and it's a lot of information all at once and somebody said to me the other day it's like starting a whole new life because you had your life when you were when she was a baby you had your life when she was a toddler and she was in in daycare and all that and that's that was your that was your life then and now you have the life of a mom with a school aged child and it's totally different so I wanted to know what your thoughts are or what your thoughts were when your kids first started school and what did you do um, what did you do if you were a working mom or even if you were a stay at home mom what did you do during the summer did you have any fun plans did you try to make it enriching every day or did you relax you know a couple days a week and just do one big trip or one one fun one big fun thing um, so let me know. I'd love to hear your thoughts. I can't believe I'm talking about summer already. It's the end of February. You can tell I'm itching for summer. Um, I, I, cause I really am. We're, we're planning, I'm rambling. I'm sorry. I'm rambling. Um, we're planning a trip to Disney World this summer, so hey, if anybody has any helpful hints about Disney World, please leave them down below. I'd love to hear them, or find me on my channel and um, and send me a private message with any tips or tricks that you may have. Um, 
So that's my little kind of rant, I guess, or or, or um, talk for this set, my segment of the Four Women Mamas. I'd love to hear you got from you guys. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And I will see you next video. Bye.